minification so if you see here this http rest http.js file i have created so all my scripts i have defined uh, uh, js related javascript related scripts i implemented in this .js file and this .js file i am using in .html file by .html file by including script src equal to rest j rest http.js file if you see here this rest http.js is 2kb file of course it is normal file big uh, simple file only because we don't have um, much script here we don't have more script here so suppose if script is um, some 16 MB or uh, 20 MB so such a huge file while loading in web server okay so it will take more amount of space so to reduce such space we have to minimize it we have to compress it okay so such concept we call minification so that how we can do minification suppose so assume this js so i am keep pasting it so now i am trying to increasing this size see now 36 kb, KB. now this file size is 36 kb now i will try to minimize the size of a file so for this we already i installed in my machine uglify.js so uglify.js So uglify.js, rest, rest http.js and output I am giving as rest http.min.js. Yes, it is generated. See this rest.min.js, this is generated with 30 KB. Okay, so 6 KB it is saved. Okay, so if you see this create this JS, so it is clubbed everything and this is how we can um, minimize the size of a uh, js file okay so we can use this js file okay of course uh, it is size is size is uh, we compress the size we can use this min.js file in our application also no problem okay this is minification uh, at present we cannot use it because uh, i copied i replicated uh, I replicated that that already scripts whatever is there that I am replicating that's why we, we cannot go for it okay now suppose if we want to use it okay I am removing mm, this one okay so yes I have now this is 2kb now I will use this one in my application this minification file i will use it in i will include that file and i will run my application see working fine now if i try to get all user i will get i will get particular user i will get and i will save and update and delete everything will work fine okay so this is how minif minification we can do so next one is ng click so ng click we already uh, discussed so ng click is a uh, on click event type so this ng click will call the method inside the controller not the javascript function of course it is javascript function inside the controller 
but uh, it will not call the direct function so for calling the direct function we use on click event to call the functions inside the controller we use the ng click directive that's what we did so in rest http.js file we have controller rest controller inside the controller i have created get method get user method and save user method and update user method and delete user method okay so these all all operations these all methods i have defined in inside the controller so that's why i use the ng click that's why i, I use ng click otherwise i cannot go for uh, ng click method i uh, if i want to use direct method call i will, i can go for uh, on click method now ng show and ng hide so ng show and ng hide these are the directives we can use if something want to display on web page we can use ng show if we want to hide something on web page we can use ng hide we will discuss these things ng show and ng hide directives so ng show directive is used to display some data on web page we use ng show if you want to hide some data we can go for ng hide okay so now i am creating one more file uh, directives tools dot html so now i am working with uh, new script directives dot js so this directive dot js so contain i am creating one controller so i am creating first one module i am creating that name i am giving directive to and the controller name i am giving directive controller and i am closing it here okay so in my directive html file so this is what i have to use and slash div slash body slash html just first i will check whether uh, data it is displaying on web page or not dollar scope dot some mp name equal to some harish harish so this employee name i am displaying in the controller so this the script file i should include directives.js and controller name and module name is directive controller name is directive controller okay now i will open this page in firefox open with firefox yes harish is displaying here fine so it means my script and html are fine now so now we can work with directives so h1 ng show ng show and ng 
हाई डायरेक्टिव स्लैश एच वन ओके एच वन एच वन ओके नाउ व्हाट आई एम ट्राइंग टू डूइंग इज आई हैव ए नंबर सो इफ इट इज ए इंटीज इफ इट इज ए ऑट आई विल डिस्प्ले इफ इट इज ए एवन I am going to hide it. So always when I click add, it will add one number on top of it. So that is what I am doing. So suppose I have number ten. If I click add, it will add one one to ten. So now my number is eleven. So it will hide. Sorry, it will display. Okay. So if it is even, if it is even, it will hide, and it will odd, it will display. That is that is. logic i am going to implementing so input type equal to type equal to mm. button button mm. mm. ng click click equal to mm. increment increment so this is the method i am calling it okay so here i am displaying uh some val so this is this is what i am doing here so val it contain at present 10 now if we see here See ten is there. Now I need to give some message on button uh, value equal to uh, increment. See, so it is not incrementing anything. Okay, so you now it is even number. It is displaying. If I click increment, it is odd number. It will hide. again if i click increment it will appear again again if i click increment it will hide so you keep on it is uh, increment or decrement depends on it it will go it will go so what i am doing is i am writing one method dollar scope dot increment dollar scope dot scope dot increment function of function of dollar scope dot val equal to some 10 otherwise what i will do is i am taking the scope dot val dollar scope dot val plus 1 return डालास्कोप डॉट वैल मॉडलेस टू डबल इक्वस जीरो सो दिस इंक्रीमेंट ओके बेटर इफ आई राइट इज ईवन ईवन सो इज ईवन मेथड आई एम राइटिंग हियर So I am calling is even. Okay. So he 
here I am taking one H1 NG show equal to is even is even slash h1 ng hide is even this is what i am doing here 